It is very much a toast to the one I love the most. Yes, my darling, it is true that my greatest love is you. To resist your tempting stance was to not to have your dance. Then I felt your soft brown hair, which was more than I could bear. When your figure posed to me a little waist of 23, a bust, a hip, oh, 37, I could only dance in heaven. Then we kissed a year away on a whitish winter's day. Till a deed by nature's will took my heart for you to show. You'd never drawn or painted before then? I used to when I was at school. Right. But I didn't like what I was drawing. Right. It didn't seem right to me. Plus, I thought drawing was a kind of female thing, actually. Mm -hmm. I think the wood part was more the man, the man thing, really. And I, was all, I always wanted to be this kind of he-man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. My, my mother was the one who could read and write properly because she was trying to be a teacher. Mm -hmm. While my father, he couldn't read and write at all. Right. But the way he dresses and the way he... well. My mother was a good dresser too, anyway. But the way he runs his water through his bamboo mm -hmm. and so forth and in his trenches and things, uh, you know. And the way he decorated his garden and things, to me, that was art, a lot of art. Was really. drawing was just for cities or women? That was, um, well, I didn't know that those things existed at one time. Remember, you know, I'm a country boy and I'm... I'm not gone to galleries nor nothing. In fact, I didn't even know. When I used to look at paintings, I used to think, oh, oh lovely things. I never questioned how, how they came about. I lost a photograph in London. And the only way I could try and remember her is to try and draw her, which I was, well, well I drew something. And it looked like her then, anyway. But that, 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 those got lost as well. But then uh, poetry started anyway. When I used to live in London, mm -hmm. there was this particular guy called Omo. He, he used to paint some pictures. When I used to work at this club, uh, cooking and jumping around and, you know, and when he goes away, I used to pinch out his paint and paint pictures. <laughs> but I used to just paint with the black paint and I used to say, that's that person and that, that person and so on. And then, you know, most of the places since I, where, where I live, since that, I'm always finding paints and just painting. Really? But what was the, like, what was the impulse? Why did you need to paint? What, what was in the made you paint? Because it it, 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 it became a challenge. It became a ch I liked it. I liked it. I liked it then. Mm -hmm. There's a drawing, yeah, but then, yeah. Now we're going into this workroom, which is now more like a studio, you might say, yeah? And uh, this is where all my apparatuses are. There's, there's quite a lot of heavy machinery up here, isn't there? Yeah. How did you get this stuff up? I, mean, there's a I drag him up. <laughs> you, you I drag him all up. Yeah. And this thing? This yeah, thing that's, there's a lead. I thought I'd need the lead, but turn out that I didn't lead, need the lead because if you notice my, my chest pieces are square mm -hmm. and the thing keeps turning around so there's no sense of me but it, it helps to sharpen my tools no 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 it helps to clean out my brushes and things like that but or my files and how things. How did you get, I mean I don't understand if, mm. how you got this up here yourself you dragged it up yourself. Drag it up drag them all up I drag everything up here <laughs> 